So there's a perpetual helicopter flying above my place, like just constantly in a circle. So if you can hear it, that's what's going on. <laughs> Did it just leave? It'll be back. <laughs> So today I wanted to share a few things that I picked up this month that I'm really excited about. Some of them are really versatile things that, you know, would fit into anybody's closet, whereas a couple others are a little bit adventurous. So let's get started. Okay, first I picked up this alpaca sweater from Everlane. You guys might have seen my earlier video where Everlane sent me a black one of these and I found that I wore it all the time and it was hard to take off, like it was so soft and comfortable. So I ended up buying one that was in blue and I've actually been wearing a little bit of this, like bringing in this color into my wardrobe a little bit because it's kind of like a jeans color, it's muted, but it still is a really beautiful blue. So yeah, I think I'm kind of experimenting with that. That color right now but I really like this sweater a lot because not only is it very soft and made out of alpaca but it's also got these awesome sleeves that kind of taper toward the end so it just has this like kind of almost puffed sleeved look to it that I really like it's just so cozy <laughs> like I can't stress that enough it's just something that I want to wear to bed honestly and I like how the crew neck here is like really thick and oversized. I think that's really beautiful. So here I'm wearing it with just some high-waisted white pants and then also my Dari boots. I feel like the natural color of the Dari boots goes well with this whole look. And then I'm just tucking the shirt into the pants in the front a little bit. So this next one was a repurchase for me. It's something that I used to have and I actually bought it again because it really made a difference in my closet. So this is the Everlane Pima stretch mock neck and a mock neck is really great because it's a little less fussy than a turtleneck and it still has that great classic vibe and I also like the fact that this one is very lightweight so it's kind of designed to be worn under things if you like to and it's stretchy so because it is made to kind of wear under things it's just a little bit see-through but it doesn't really bother me if I want to wear it alone but it's just kind of preference I think so yeah I bought one of these back in 2017 but because the nature of this is that it's very thin and it's white so it's just naturally going to get dingy especially the more you wear it under things and if you're warm. This will be something that you probably won't be able to like donate or sell after you use it, but it is something that I find really important to wear. And I also like the fact of how it looks when it is underneath a sweater. I think it's really cute and just gives a whole different look to an outfit. So the next thing that I got was something a little bit more casual for a top. You can't really get more casual than this. This is an Everlane long sleeve tee and it's you know, basically the same thing as their pocket tees that maybe you've tried them where it's just a really nice short sleeve. So this is just the long sleeve version of that. Something really super casual. And the way that I like to wear this is you can dress it up if you like. Um, so the way that I'm wearing it here is with high waisted black pants and then also some black boots. And I just like to kind of build from there. This is winter time. So having really classic basic shirts underneath is great. Speaking of building on that outfit, the next thing that I'm adding to this outfit is a new coat that I got, which is from Frankie Shop. And it's so oversized. It's like a menswear coat. And that's just really fun to be able to wear. It's so comfortable. It feels like you're wearing a giant blanket. And I just have really enjoyed wearing it around. I think that it's nice to be able to shop from um, the Frankie Shop because they have different like they have very few sizes. They have a, a small medium, which is my preference when I shop there. Otherwise, if you're not petite, they also have coats that are one size. And so I think that it's great to be able to just have something that works for most people. And just the fact that I'm petite and can still pull off a like menswear coat is, it's a challenge, but I'm really excited that this one works for my body size. Next, there was a sale going on with Jessie Cam. And so it was like on her fall and winter pieces. So I took advantage of that and I kind of bought something kind of adventurous. So these are overalls. They're really fun to be able to wear and just try out different styles with different shirts underneath. Something like the shirt I'm wearing right now would completely give this look a different vibe than like a really classic t-shirt. So I like to be able to just kind of play with how I'm feeling that day and I've enjoyed wearing these so much. 
I also appreciate that they have a raw hem, hem, so they're designed to just be rolled at the bottom. So that just saves me a trip to the tailor. And of course, overalls are naturally, like you can adjust the height. I haven't worn overalls since like in a really long time. So I'm just really excited to be able to wear them again and kind of change up my look a little bit. They're really cool too, because I wanted overalls that kind of looked like I was going to go paint in them, like that type of like painter's look. They're like, they're not lined or anything. They're just raw cotton canvas. So it really helps with that painter's vibe of just having that cotton canvas look. I'm really loving the utilitarian look that's going around right now. I think that this is kind of in that realm. Next, I picked up just a few pieces from Free People. The first one was this shirt that I'm wearing right now. I really like to have like Victorian, really feminine shirts and pair them with casual pieces. And so this was just another example of that. I love the sleeves. <laughs> and they also have this lettuce hem to it, lettuce edge hem, that's really fun. And then it's also got like a crocheted type of pattern. I know there's a word for it, I can't think of it. But I also like the fact that it's a little bit see-through, like it's not too much, but it's just enough to be able to just have that feminine look again. And of course, because it's more like cropped, I like to wear it with high-waisted pants. The ones I'm wearing right now are from Elizabeth Suzanne, they're silk pants and I've worn them for like a couple years. So I like to be able to wear high-waisted pants whenever I'm wearing one of these crop shirts. And then in this instance, I'm wearing, with, I'm wearing them with these Cezanne boots um, that I love so much. And then I'm not wearing them with <laughs> these, <laughs> which are my little bunny slippers. Um, but for a much more chic look, then you can definitely wear the Cezanne boots. <laughs> And then from Free People, I also got just a couple pairs of flare jeans. They're the exact same pant, only they come in, this one I bought in uh, like a blue and a black. And the reason why I think that I wanted to try the flare jean is because it's supposed to make your legs look really long if you get pairs that are extra long and you wear heels with them. So that is the benefit there. I think that these ones are beautifully thin, like right near the knee. I do wonder if they will work just right for my body style. So again, I think it comes back to how I style them. They're really fun if you wanna be able to try some flare jeans. They brought me back to my 10 year challenge. Like I used to always wear bell bottoms, flare jeans, only they were low rise, which wasn't doing me any favors at all. So it's fun to be able to kind of experiment with the high rise, with wearing them extra long. So I'm, I'm, I'm on the fence, but I think I'm gonna keep them and just kind of like play with how I style them and make them work. I also wanted to mention that I went for these because they were in the size short, like you could actually specify your height, which is so important when you're getting flare jeans that they actually start flaring right below the knee. And you know, if you had gotten regular sized flare jeans, then they're not going to do that just right. Okay, so just a couple more things that I got. One was a sweatshirt from Aloe. I have been loving this so much. I wore it on my plane trip, which was so comfortable. And then I also wear it like right before workouts while I'm warming up. And then I also just wear it kind of dressed up too. So it has, it's like a really versatile piece. It's gonna go a long way in my closet. And a couple things that I really liked about it is that it has a raw edge hem right here. Like it's, it's something that's just cut right off. And then I also like the fact that it, the sleeves are extra long and exaggerated. So that cropped kind of goes a long way. I think that that makes a huge difference whenever I'm wearing something bulky like a sweatshirt, that it's cropped. And yeah, like I just absolutely love this. Today I'm wearing it with my black high-waisted pants again and also my black boots. And then I'm also just adding just a little coin necklace that makes the outfit look a little bit more like I'm going out and a little bit less like I'm going to the gym. <laughs> the last thing that I picked up was a pair of Levi's that are ribcage jeans and they have a really unique style but one that I'm really drawn to with most of my pants. So they are like a street leg look and they're high rise and overall, I think that I will keep them. I still have been like on the fence, but after reviewing the tape, I think that I will. I think that they're going to actually give me a long, um, a, like, like change up my wardrobe a lot. And today I'm just wearing them with my Everlane mock neck from earlier. So really cool look, very casual, very basic, but still very unique too. So that's what I like to go for is things that are versatile, will add a lot of like different looks to my wardrobe. and. 
I think that I'm really excited about all these pieces. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep them all after seeing them all, I think that, and just like trying out different outfits. I'm pretty happy with all of them. So thanks guys for watching and I hope that your month is going absolutely amazing and I'll see you guys next time, bye. Like straight or wide leg look to them. Oh, he's kind of stressy now.